Had it over day two. Uh, drew a good one of Blake Sharps named Boomerang. Uh, be a pretty good matchup today. Uh, Head it over. Get ready. Get started. And, uh, get loosened up. And get stretched out. Second man out. And uh, set the bar high. Shoot for a round win. And uh, go home in that short round. And pick me a good one. And ride him and go home. So, day two. Do you shoot boss again today? Or are you going to be a judge? Oh, you're just a judge today? Is it, did all them board riders make it? Did all them, no? A couple of them did though? I know Webster, the bullfighters made it. But only a handful of them made it? What did you draw today? Chupacabra, Blake Sharp. I don't know, first oh, out. I'm second beaver, out. Sean? Nice. Huh? You got dirty beaver. Yes. Oh yeah, baby. Bless you. Thanks, Corner. Hey, thank you. Take a hole in them things. Hey, gotta like old Corner. <laughs> Boomerang of Blake Sharps. Should be, he's like a dark brown, almost black. Uh, he looks brown or dark red, whatever you want to call it. I've never been on him, I've seen him a bunch of times. He's good, should start left, go right, or stay left, but I did see him in Florida act like he was going to go left and go back right. So that's the first time I've ever seen him do that, but uh, he's good. He'll work out just fine. At this sport, you got to make sure they all work out just fine. When the gate bangs, you, you do what you, you've trained yourself to do. So it ain't no big deal. Just ride the bull, win the prize. Hands a little swollen. I got a sausage finger. Game of inches, literally. Oh, uh, this bracelet, uh, it don't signify nothing. Uh, I've always wore a bracelet. It's like a necklace. I've always wore a necklace. I just, uh, for Gentry got me, my girlfriend got me this gold chain for uh, being together for two years. I used to wear a, a cross with a green over it, but uh, the bracelet, I've had some that are magnetic. I've had some that are copper. This one's just, a little bit of magnetic, but it's it's good for your body, so I wear it, and it also looks good. So that's one thing about it; you gotta look good too. There's a couple of sour in there, ain't they? Oh, they put reason why I'm right here. Hey, he wasn't that bad. Yeah, he wasn't that bad, I didn't think. 
I think he just lost. I think I'd rather top dollar to cool it. I don't know. It's hard. It is very hard. I've been on the cool whip. They got on him at the World Finals. I don't like Muley. Yeah, I don't like Muley's either. Muley's try a little harder to kill you. <laughs> they know how to use their feet. Yeah. They're more aware of where they're at because they don't have them big handlebars to grab you. When you out. Oh, you're dead last. You got a minute. When I get home and put my lace ups on, Bob. Huh? They feel good. I put them on warm a little bit. I don't wear them outside. I wear them inside. Yeah. So I don't tear them up. I bought found them on eBay for seventy, like not even seventy, like fifty-five, sixty bucks, and not even they're brand new, never been worn. What are they, Justin? Justin lace ups, the old school lace ups. I had me a pair of um. They were made out of buffalo hide. They were Justin's, and I wore them for six, seven years. I roped in them and stuff, and I finally blew the ends out, the backs out of them. I blew the back, like the piece where it stitches right here on the back. That's where it blew out at. And I took him to the guy. He goes, I can't fix that. He's like, I'm like, that's fine. That's all I needed to know. Oh, I'd rip heels off boots, put holes in the bottom of them. Craig just walked by everybody. <laughs> you ain't hurting my video. I'm surprised I ain't broke the camera yet. He's really pretty cool. He's funny. Remember that kid, Colton Hevelo? Man, oh man, that's 
a big, big ride. That'll get you a pick and the Monster Energy Champion, Chip Rapp. All right, Bobby. The slide ride, my man. Crack and rash, here we go. Caden Bunch will have the number one pick in the draft. He better pick wisely because the rest of the men have won. If Caden bucks off, he leaves the door open for the rest of the field. And here in Milwaukee, young Colton Havilo, the man from the Show Me State of Missouri. He is solid right now with 88 and three quarter points. He has ridden his way to the number two position. We're going to Colton Havilo now. 88 three quarter points. You got. Nine bowls left up there. You're looking at it. I feel like you're looking at it for the first time. What do you like? Smoke set like that? No? Great. He kept it PG, everybody. Corner line for the uh, cool whip. Cool whip. Top left hand corner there. Cool. Gambler's jersey on. It looks like he is part of the team. Let's do this. Look up there at the weekend standings. Kevin Bunch has two scores on the board. We are down to the final two. Colton Hepelo is on the back of one of the biggest, baddest bulls in the world. This is Cool Whip. We highlight this bull at the top of the show. He has got to ride this bull. Hello will have to do something that 51 other men have not been able to do. And that is why this pulled eight seconds. The only man to do it in the very first season that Cool Whip showed up. He has been perfect. 51 fuck offs. Yeah. And Cool Kate Harrison on CBS Sports Net. Milwaukee, Wisconsin, uh, finished the day off today, uh, won the long round, went two for two going in the short round. Uh, unfortunately, boy, I wanted, I didn't get the pick in the short round. They had him first three ride, but uh, picked a rematch, cool whip, butt me off at the World Finals at like six and a half, seven seconds. I was thinking, you know what, slay the dragon, be the hero, be the badass, and uh, unfortunately, Sometimes you're the eagle and sometimes you're the chicken and I was the chicken, so I got bucked off, but healthy you ended up winning second place and uh, on the Little Rock next weekend.